A continuous spectrum is produced from a spark. All the colors of the visible spectrum are shown here. If the spark is active in a container of hydrogen gas, the gas is first dissociated into atoms and the electrons are promoted to higher energy levels. As the electrons fall back, they emit light, giving a discrete line spectrum. Shown here is the Balma series. Iron gives a discrete spectrum different from other atoms. The emission spectral lines occur at well-defined wavelengths. These fingerprint an element which can be later used to identify that element. Sodium and iron have different emission spectra. This formula generates a series of energy levels and the transitions between these levels give various bands. For the Lyman series, the electrons end up in the lowest ground state. For the Balmer series, they all end up in the second state. And for the Ritz-Passion series, all the emitted electrons end up in the third state.